This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. Come on. We going? Has it gone? Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there. Muddled. You seek someone. Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But... There's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? Besides, the innkeep's my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. Run, Roach. So, a griffin this close to the village? Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest to the mountains, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard.
What? Take that down before there's trouble. That is a coat of arms. The Temerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is! I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm-hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? Who is he? Alive. Send his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Looking for a woman. Raven-haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, Lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Thanks. Master Witches, would you... I killed livestock at first, but it's got... To... If someone will pay us, won't say no. Help you bandage that up? Please. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Black one's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. Better that than burning the harvest. Once more, there are four factions. Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapses. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night, black and white, gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. <laughs> 